So earlier this morning, a new PV trailer for Chainsaw Man that is 15 seconds in length came out. And when you look at the overall length, for instance, only 15 seconds, that isn't anything to write home about. However, what was within this said trailer is what is worth talking about, and I think is one of the big reasons why it is the talk of the town and why it's even sitting at 2.2 million views at this moment, which I think is telling to the amount of hype that is generated around this series to just the excellent manga, to just the hype of the anime that is incoming very soon. There is just so much discussion around the series, and for good reason. It's a good series that does deserve to be talked about. And so, to get into the actual main meat of what this video is about, it's to talk about what this preview trailer has within it, and why I think it's very important, because it's a continuation on a video I made a few days ago about the leaks for Chainsaw Man, and to get everybody up to speed, a few days ago, there was an individual that decided to have a big brain play to literally at, at, Crunchyroll, like, tagged him into a post while leaking footage from a private event for the first episode. Like, recorded a private event for the first episode of Chainsaw Man and had this potato quality at an angle recording of a certain sequence that was in the first episode, which is this, actually. It's this stuff we see here within this PV trailer. And to make sure we're also on the same page, when that leak came out, there was a lot of people that were just downright saying that Chainsaw Man is going to be a failure on release. Now, I'm not saying it is or isn't. I'm not defending. I'm not trying to do anything like that because I will be critical when the series comes out if it does look bad or whatever. But the point is, is that you can't judge a series from a 20 second clip with potato quality on a phone at a private event at an angle. I'm just going to be honest there. It's the truth. If you don't like that, I don't know what else to say, but that is the truth. And so people were instantly saying that it looked ugly, that the episode looked ugly, it was going to be a failure of an episode, what is that CGI, etc. And when people think of CGI, their mind instantly gravitates towards, oh no, CGI, it's going to look ugly. That, that That's what people are probably instantly going to think. But the thing is, is that CGI can be done right. And this trailer shows that very scene that leaked, which I think that this was intentional. I really think that the way this came out after we saw that leak a few days ago, I believe that this trailer, at least the parts it showed, was incredibly intentional. That is my two cents on the matter. But um, anyways, the scene in question is basically this brief little CGI transformation sequence with Denji turning into Chainsaw Man in the first episode. It's a nice little PV. And in movement, like if you actually look at the movement of this sequence, it looks good. It legitimately looks good for CGI, and this is the scene that people were complaining about saying looked ugly, and this is why we shouldn't judge something that is a 20 second potato quality leak. I'm glad that this trailer came out today. It puts to rest the drama that was kind of circulating in the community. I know there was people on uh, my anime list that were actually posting early reviews saying that Chainsaw Man is going to be bad because of just that leak. It is insane to me. Like, like, look, I love Chainsaw Man. I really do like the manga. I'm not going to say that the anime is going to be perfect because obviously it's not out yet. But it's crazy to me just how toxic the fandom of Chainsaw Man is. And the series isn't even out yet. Like, the anime isn't out yet. And it's just wild. I know there is a lot of good eggs out there in the community that's been around for a while. I'm not saying everybody is. But there is a good, I guess, vocal minority that is just outright toxic. And I guess it comes with the territory. When a series gets popular enough which Chainsaw Man has exploded in popularity, the community can get very, very toxic. And it just, it's wild. Like, um, here's someone that actually posted about it. I did, um, they follow me, actually. Hey, shout out to you. Um, they, um, they posted the image from the trailer, the PV, and then they showed the leaked footage. Look at that leaked footage for a second. Look at that leak. Look how ugly that looks. Like, legitimately. 
That looks so bad. How can anyone in the right state of mind say all of Chainsaw Man's anime is going to be bad from a potato looking quality like that, and then you compare it to the actual footage that came out, and in movement, it looks great. I just showed you that earlier. You can go back in the video and see it. It's wild. It's absolutely wild when you just look at the pixel fragments of this. It's just... Oh... Oh, man. But, um, another thing, too. One thing I do want to kind of throw in. Um, I believe my boy Yonko actually posted this. Let me, uh, let me see here. So, Yonko here posted, I believe, the character sheet designs. Yeah, here it is. For, uh, Chainsaw Man earlier. And there is some people complaining about Makima's design. And if you don't know why they're kind of complaining, it's because she doesn't have a dump truck. And... I guess you can kind of understand what I mean by that. Yeah, there's been so much fan art of Makima for years now, and there's just so much expectation, I guess, from Makima, the way people's perception of her is just through fan art, that they think that she's going to just be this big dump truck character, and that's actually not the case whatsoever, and there's some people that are a little bit upset with this design, <laughs> it's, it's funny, it's honestly, I have to say, if there's anything that, you know, is actually very funny, it is that. But, um, yeah, I just kind of wanted to talk about this. I I'm glad to kind of put to rest, though, the CGI, like, uh, section of Chainsaw Man that people were complaining about. Because this is a really, really good, um, PV. Like, seriously, go watch it if you haven't. Um, I'm excited, because Chainsaw Man's first episode is probably going to be... It's gonna break the internet. At least anime community is gonna break the internet. Like, I... I I, I can't wait. I, I seriously just cannot wait. But, um, yeah, I guess I'll leave it at that. Thank you so much for watching. I just wanted to do a brief little update video kind of discussing the stuff that came out a few days ago because it's kind of like a continuation of that story. But, uh, yeah, you all have a wonderful day or night wherever you live. If you enjoyed the video, please leave me a like. It does help me out a lot. But with that, Chibi out.